been a winter of discontent for Australian retailers and the big two, Meyer and David Jones, have been among the hardest hit. So Meyer is banking on bouncing back and has spared no expense in preparing for a summer fashion blitz. Spearheading the campaign are Jennifer Hawkins and Jess Hart. Linda Kincaid has this exclusive report from their summer catalogue shoot. Rolling desert dunes, sandy white beaches, a summer safari. How beautiful is it? Enter two of Australia's hottest models, Jennifer Hawkins and Jessica Hart. Live your life, live your life. It's really cool. It's so awesome here. The scene now set to launch Maya's sizzling new campaign. A little bit more of the detail in the neck, Jen, just a little bit, not as much, not as much there. In Western Australia today, tonight's been invited for an exclusive behind the scenes tour. How's it been so far this morning? Oh, it's been so much fun. We just shot uh, two dresses and we got we got up at about 3.30, so that was interesting. <laughs> <laughs> we saw the Ugg boots. Oh yeah, the Ugg boots this morning. There's, there's hot water bottles, there's dressing gowns, there's Ugg boots, there's the whole behind the scenes is not so glamorous, believe me. This is the Pinnacles, about a three hour drive north of Perth and home to these incredible limestone structures which are thought to be about 30,000 years old. They're kind of like little teeth. <laughs> the sand dunes of Cervantes star in the show. How does this compare to studio shoots when you're, you know, you're not dealing with the elements? Well, you know, there's, there's you know, pros and cons to everything. I mean, you get the amazing sort of outlook of all the sand dunes and being outside and the fresh air and everything but obviously studio it's like covered and it's controllable and the crystal waters of the coral coast a picture-perfect backdrop for Cozzy I'm sexy and I know it what Cozzy's shall we see this summer oh many I'm very excited <laughs> the fabrics are beautiful some are from Italy some of the trends are from Spain so just sort of stepped it up a notch our makeup room and our changing room, our everything room. So these are all the clothes we've been shooting. It looks a lot smaller than it is. We've had a lot to do, believe me. Sass and Bide, new to the Maya stable of stars, created this little number. Karen Walker's got some awesome things that I loved wearing. And of course this uh, beautiful Ellery dress. And Kim's here with us. Up and coming designer Kim Ellery is a local Perth girl. What's it like having some of your collection at the forefront of this campaign? Oh, it's very exciting. I saw the images of Jess and she looks amazing. Did you get to bring Jake along this time? No, I just sent him a photo though. In the early hours of the morning wrapped in white, Jen has another article of clothing in that colour on her mind. I've definitely got a vision, with, you know, in my head. The face of Maya says she's on the hunt for the perfect wedding gown. After her beau of seven years, Jake Wall, popped the question. I just love him. <laughs> Can you almost guarantee that it will be an Aussie designer, perhaps a Maya designer, um, designing your, your gown for your wedding? I'm not sure yet. I'm going over to New York actually, so I might check out some things over there. Across the country, retail spending has slumped. David Jones has posted its worst sales result in more than two decades, down 19%, while Maya has fallen more than 6%. Sales promotion manager Jemima White is hoping this campaign will reinvigorate consumer spending. It's a great new season up ahead, so I encourage you to come in and have a look. If someone had to pick up just one outfit for this summer, what would you recommend? A beautiful maxi dress. It's a winner. I'm sexy and I know it. Yeah, gorgeous shots in a beautiful part of Australia. Linda Kincaid reporting on Maya's big blitz to get people shopping again. Interesting to see if it works. Here's what's ahead.